it's good to see you back on the island, Dr. Worcester. Or wait, now, you're a reverend now, aren't you? What, what am I supposed uh, to... Aylwood's fine. What brings you this time? Sasquatch, Donald? <laughs> I'm here for freshwater mussels. I've never tried those before. Pearls? Cabot's brought a handful back to the king. I figure if they could find some, maybe I might as well. Why would a wealthy man like you come all the way back to Newfoundland for pearls? How's the hospitality business? That's good, boy. Guides are bringing them in. Who'd you hire this time, anyway? Well, I only hire one man when I come here, and he's the best. So that was a cold night. Cold enough to kill you. I was very tired. I had walked a long way. But I knew that if I rest, the fire would go out and I would freeze to death. <laughs> so I went down to the pond and I break the ice on the pond. I drank the cold water. I drank as much as I could. Then I went back to my campfire and I laid down to rest. But soon, Soon I had to get up again to take a piss. <laughs> well, then I went back to the campfire. William, you've been told not to go around that filthy engine. That doesn't bother no one, man. Yes, but if your father sees you there with him again, it'll come to blood. Now get. Good morning, Reverend. Mr. Mitchell, you ready to go? Where do you suppose we're going to find these pearls, Matty? Muskrats go where the mussels are. This is beautiful country. Blanche would love it here. Uh, uh, Matty! Uh, Matty! Is this the place? Can I assist you at all? What is it? No peril? Bad muscle. Maybe we should stop for today. There doesn't seem to be very many mussels around here. How would there have to be? 
uh, the muskrats go where the mussels are. Isn't that right? Maybe uh, we have better luck tomorrow, farther up river. For now, we should rest and eat. I don't want to rest and eat. I want to find pearls. The pearls are here. We will find them. For now, we should eat. tomorrow. Better lock up, River. Uh-huh. Gone! My wallet's gone. Someone's been going through my bag. That was the last of my money. Without that wallet, I can't pay you. I can't get home. I'm ruined! Oh, I knew this was a fool's errand. Coming all the way to Newfoundland looking for pearls. It sounds like the plan of a madman. What was I thinking? I just thought this was my last chance to turn things around. My business is failing. My livelihood is in jeopardy. And all I can think to do is travel across the continent looking for pearls that apparently we're never going to find. Where are you going? You wait here. I'll be back by morning. Give me Dr. Worcester's money. <laughs> oh, but I give you half. <laughs> One more word and you die. <laughs> my, 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 my pocket! My pocket! You scared the piss out of me, you savage! Smells like more than that scared out of you. Watch your back, Chief. If you ever come to my camp again, you die. Remember, I can find you anywhere, anytime.
How did you track it down? White man built big fire. Stand back. Indian built small fire. Stay close. We go this way. Pleasure's all mine, Mr. Mitchell. You come back again, maybe next year. God willing. I haven't seen the South Coast yet. I hear Long Harbor River thick with salmon. It's not as bad as all that, dear. I'm gonna go to the bank tomorrow and see if I can borrow us some more time. Enough about all that. Uh, well, what are we gonna do about dinner? Well, it doesn't look like you're starving. Oh, I almost forgot. Someone dropped off a parcel for you today while you were out. P.O.D.? Do I even want to know how much that cost? Not very fond of lobster. Who would send me this? exception, Maddie Mitchell was the greatest, most resourceful guide and woodsman I have ever known, and certainly a man of his word. Through the years, I've been back to Newfoundland several times. Heck, I even brought my wife once or twice. He died in 1921 and is buried in Cornerbrook, Newfoundland. Maddie was a legendary man with legendary stories, and I was proud to call him my friend. Hardy and hale, 
His hands were like two axes, his face was like stone His head was like the mountain with the sun going down His head was like the mountain with the sun going down He rode upon the river, he sailed along the bay He walked along the mountain in a marvelous way A marvelous country, a marvelous man Make my Maddie Mitchell walking on Big Mom Eddie Mitchell walking over the land. Justice on the mountain, honor and pride. Run from the mountain, but you know you can't hide. He steps across the valley, he looks into the sky. Wood, wind, and water on the day that you die. Wood, wind, and water on the day that you die. Wood, wind, and water, fire and stone. Blood, salt, tobacco, muscle and bone Heart of the eagle, high up in the sky A blessing for the morning and a tear in the eye A blessing for the morning and a tear in the eye He rode upon the river, he sailed along the bay He walked upon the mountain in a marvelous way A marvelous country Marvelous man, make my Maddie Mitchell walking over the land. Make my Maddie Mitchell walking over the land. Come sit down by the fire, and I'll tell you a tale, a story about a man who was hardy and hale. His hands were like two axes, his face was like stone. His head was like the mountain with the sun going down. His head was like the mountain with the sun going down. Marvelous country, marvelous man, marvelous country, marvelous man, a marvelous country, a marvelous.